Are you on the hunt for the perfect sunscreen to protect your skin this summer? Look no further because today we bring you a roundup of the newest arrivals in sunscreens from French Pharmacy. From oily to dry skin, including sensitive and atopic skin, we'll show you the latest products in sun protection so that you can find the perfect fit for your skin. Hi, I'm Yara and I'm Joana and we're cosmetics experts at care to beauty Sunscreen is the most important step in a skincare routine, so it's key that you find one that you like to apply every day. If you're always on the search for a good sunscreen for your skin and still haven't found one that you like, today we bring you the latest launches from 2023. And we already tested them for dark skin up to phototype 5 and for eye stinging as well, so we can give you that information. Shall we start? Let's go! We start off with Caudalie Vino Sun Protect Cream SPF 50. Caudalie only had one facial sunscreen, a fluid one, and now we have this one, a cream. Like the fluid version, it is vegan and it has an antioxidant rich composition, so it also provides an anti wrinkle action. And let's try it. It has a nice creamy texture, but it's quite fluid, it feels hydrating, and it leaves an invisible finish. And I like the summery fragrance. This sunscreen is indicated for all skin types, including sensitive skin, but I feel like it's best recommended for normal to dry skin. And the brand doesn't have a sunscreen range for children, but this one is suitable from 3 years old. You will like this sunscreen if you are looking for a vegan, creamy sunscreen with an anti-wrinkle action, especially if you have normal to dry skin. It is dark skin friendly and eye friendly. Let's go to the next one, Eucerin Sun Hydro Protect Ultra Fluid SPF 50+. Plus. I'm really curious about this one because of the texture and I think it's interesting that it showed to be suitable for hot and humid climates which is a cool piece of information for people who live in countries with these conditions. It provides protection against UV rays and visible light as well and the formula contains hyaluronic acid and NMFs to hydrate the skin at the same time. Let's try it. It is really fluid, which I personally like. It absorbs really fast and has an invisible finish without leaving any sticky or greasy feeling. I think this would suit my combination skin perfectly. I can see why. Also, the lightweight formula makes me feel like this probably pleases all skin types and is suitable even for sensitive skin. I like the smell as well. It smells like summer. Given that this sunscreen is suitable for all skin types, Choose this sunscreen if you like hydrating formulas that feel lightweight. It is dark skin friendly and eye friendly. Now let's try this one from Letty, the 84 Defense Fluid. It was formulated with the topic skin in mind, so the formula is fragrance free and suitable for the whole family including children from one year old. Additionally, the formal grain is very high in broad spectrum protection against UV rays, visible light and infrared and it is also sand, sweat and water resistant. Let's try it. It says fluid and it does have a nice fluid texture and an invisible finish. Yes, and you can still feel that it is quite nourishing. If you have a toppy skin or sensitive skin and prefer lightweight textures, you'll enjoy the nourishing and fluid formula of this sunscreen and it's dark skin friendly. Sensilish has also been active in launching new sunscreens and they just launched Pure Age Perfection 50 for oily and acne prone skin. And like all products from the brand, it is specially formulated for sensitive skin. The formula is vegan and it contains prebiotics, which is something that is trending right now in the cosmetic business. Let's try it. It is like a cream, which is an interesting choice of formulation for oily skin. And the scent is not too intense. Definitely. I feel like this is probably best for someone who is looking to apply just one product in their skincare routine because it has sebum regulating properties but still hydrates the skin. This sunscreen is for you if you don't like a strong mattifying result and are looking for hydration even though you have oily skin or acne. It is also dark skin friendly and eye friendly. 
Now let's move on to a stick sunscreen, Heliocare 360 Pediatric Stick. Are stick sunscreen something you use often? Kind of. I don't use it for myself, but I use it on my son because his skin is more sensitive and it's a practical way to reapply sunscreen. It protects from UV radiation, visible light and infrared and it's water and sweat resistant, which is great for children. Yes, and this one is indicated for children over two years old, so I'm really curious to try it out. It has an intense kind of vanilla scent. I like that it's really invisible and you can see that immediately by the stick itself. It is easy to apply and glides well on the skin. I don't have to spread it with my hands. It's really practical. You like this sunscreen if you're looking for a practical way to reapply sunscreen, especially on children, and it's dark skin friendly. Okay, now let's talk about this one from Nishdim, Photo Ultra Redness. The name says it all, it's for redness prone skin, so it offers very high protection while reducing redness and soothing the skin. It protects from UV rays and visible light as well. It has a really interesting formula with soothing and antioxidant ingredients and it's fragrance free. It has niacinamide, for example, I love niacinamide because it suits my skin, but let's try it. The texture is really lightweight, which isn't something that often when it comes to sunscreens for redness prone skin. It absorbs really fast, it didn't leave a greasy feeling behind and leaves a natural and invisible finish. You'll like this sunscreen if you have redness prone skin and prefer fragrance free options. And it is dark skin friendly and eye friendly. We hope you liked this video, you can find all the products mentioned in the description below and you can buy them on our website. If you've already tried these sunscreens, share your opinion with us in the comment section. And don't forget to like and hit subscribe to see all of our upcoming videos. On our next video, we'll talk about tinted sunscreens options, so sign up to get notified and don't miss out. See you next time!